Proverbs 29 He who is often reproved yet stiffens his neck will suddenly be broken beyond healing When the righteous are in authority the people rejoice but when the wicked rule the people groan He who loves wisdom makes his father glad but one who keeps company with harlots squanders his substance by justice a king gives stability to the land but one who exacts gifts ruins it a man who flatters his neighbor spreads a net for his feet an evil man is ensnared in his transgression but a righteous man sings and rejoices A righteous man knows the rights of the poor a wicked man does not understand such knowledge scoffers set a city aflame but wise men turn away wrath if a wise man has an argument with a fool the fool only rages and laughs and there is no quiet bloodthirsty men hate one who is blameless and the wicked seek his life a fool gives full vent to his anger but a wise man quietly holds it back if a ruler listens to falsehood all his officials will be wicked the poor man and the oppressor meet together the lord gives light to the eyes of both if a king judges the poor with equity his throne will be established forever the rod and reproof give wisdom but a child left to himself brings shame to his mother when the wicked are in authority transgression increases but the righteous will look upon their downfall Discipline your son and he will give you rest he will give delight to your heart where there is no prophecy the people cast off restraint but blessed is he who keeps the law by mere words a servant is not disciplined for though he understands he will not give heed do you see a man who is hasty in his words there is more hope for a fool than for him he who pampers his servant from childhood will in the end find him his heir a man of wrath stirs up strife and a man given to anger causes much transgression a man's pride will bring him low but he who is lowly in spirit will obtain honor the partner of a thief hates his own life he hears the curse but discloses nothing the fear of man lays a snare but he who trusts in the lord is safe many seek the favor of a ruler but from the lord a man gets justice An unjust man is an abomination to the righteous but he whose way is straight is an abomination to the wicked Proverbs 30 Sayings of Agur The words of Agur son of Jeka of Masa The man says to Ethiel to Ethiel and you call Surely I am too stupid to be a man. I have not the understanding of a man. I have not learned wisdom, nor have I knowledge of the Holy One. Who has ascended to heaven and come down? Who has gathered the wind in his fists? Who has wrapped up the waters in a garment? Who has established all the ends of the earth? What is his name and what is his son's name Surely you know Every word of God 
proves true he is a shield to those who take refuge in him do not add to his words lest he rebuke you and you be found a liar two things i ask of thee deny them not to me before i die remove far from me falsehood and lying give me neither poverty nor riches feed me with the food that is needful for me lest i be full and deny thee and say who is the lord or lest i be poor and steal and profane the name of my god do not slander a servant to his master lest he curse you and you be held guilty there are those who curse their fathers and do not bless their mothers there are those who are pure in their own eyes but are not cleansed of their filth there are those how lofty are their eyes how high their eyelids lift there are those whose teeth are swords whose teeth are knives to devour the poor from off the earth the needy from among men the leech has two daughters give give they cry three things are never satisfied for never say enough shoal the barren womb the earth ever thirsty for water and the fire which never says enough the eye that mocks a father and scorns to obey a mother will be picked out by the ravens of the valley and eaten by the vultures three things are too wonderful for me for i do not understand the way of an eagle in the sky the way of a serpent on a rock the way of a ship on the high seas and the way of a man with a maiden this is the way of an adulteress she eats and wipes her mouth and says i have done no wrong under three things the earth trembles under four it cannot bear up a slave when he becomes king and a fool when he is filled with food an unloved woman when she gets a husband and a maid when she succeeds her mistress four things on earth are small but they are exceedingly wise the ants are a people not strong yet they provide their food in the summer the badgers are a people not mighty yet they make their homes in the rocks the locusts have no king yet all of them march in rank the lizard you can take in your hands yet it is in king's palaces three things are stately in their tread four are stately in their stride the lion which is mightiest among beasts and does not turn back before any the starting cock the he goat and a king striding before his people if you have been foolish exalting yourself or if you have been devising evil put your hand on your mouth for pressing milk produces curds pressing the nose produces blood and pressing anger produces strife proverbs 31 the teaching of king lemuel's mother the words of lemuel king of masa which his mother taught him what my son what son of my womb what son of my vows give not your strength to women your ways to those who destroy kings it is not for kings o lemuel it is not for kings to drink wine or for rulers to desire strong drink lest they drink and forget what has been decreed and pervert the rights of all the afflicted give strong drink to him 
who is perishing and wine to those in bitter distress let them drink and forget their poverty and remember their misery no more open your mouth for the dumb for the rights of all who are left desolate open your mouth judge righteously maintain the rights of the poor and needy owed to a capable wife a good wife who can find she is far more precious than jewels the heart of her husband trusts in her and he will have no lack of gain she does him good and not harm all the days of her life she seeks wool and flax and works with willing hands she is like the ships of the merchant she brings her food from afar she rises while it is yet night and provides food for her household and tasks for her maidens she considers her field and buys it with the fruit of her hands she plants her vineyard she girds her loins with strength and makes her arms strong she perceives that her merchandise is profitable her lamp does not go out at night she puts her hands to the distaff and her hands hold the spindle she opens her hand to the poor and reaches out her hands to the needy she is not afraid of snow for her household for all her household are clothed in scarlet She makes herself coverings her clothing is fine linen and purple her husband is known in the gates when he sits among the elders of the land she makes linen garments and sells them she delivers girdles to the merchant strength and dignity are her clothing and she laughs at the time to come she opens her mouth with wisdom and the teaching of kindness is on her tongue she looks well to the ways of her household and does not eat the bread of idleness her children rise up and call her blessed her husband also and he praises her many women have done excellently but you surpass them all charm is deceitful and beauty is vain but a woman who fears the lord is to be praised give her of the fruit of her hands and let her works praise her in the gates